welcome back to Upper Low Gaming and welcome back to Farpoint. I know it's been a while, uh, real life's gotten away from me. I'm sorry, you guys understand, I know you guys, you guys, you, you know, you know. But yeah, I'm moving out, just finished school, just graduated. Now I'm trying to get certified for some things. Can't really go too much into that, but anyways, I'm back doing this. Um, in the next few weeks might be like a little rocky for me with uh, getting consistent videos out. So I might be doing like one or two a week, but then after everything settles, I'll be able to start back up and do my usual three a week. But um, as of right now in Farpoint, what we've done so far is I've gotten to this place, check it out. Not very far in the game, maybe like 20 minutes in. Uh, turns out my Elgato decided not to record earlier, so that footage is gone forever. But it's cool because you didn't miss much. I was just shooting like little baby spiders, really. And I got, oops. The shotgun, check it out. Isn't this sweet? Seven rounds in one clip. Um, maybe six, no, seven, seven. But check out how it loads. It goes like faster as it loads up. It's pretty sweet, I love it. You can also add grenade launchers right here in this little uh, orange area. Um, with this uh, auto rifle, it's energy based. So when it overheats like that, I have to wait for it to cool down. It comes with a rocket launcher, but it is not, it doesn't have any ammo for that right now. So let's keep moving. That's all you've missed. Like seriously, that's it. That's all you've missed. I promise. I wouldn't do that to you. Just the right way. Uh, okay. That's another piece of the pilgrim. Alert. Movement detected. Okay. Multiple sources, multiple directions. Cool. That's fine. Um, so it looks like, what the hell is that shadow right there? That shadow, right there. That's not, oh my god, is that up there? Oh jeez, those are big bones. Oh, okay, well. Crap. All right, let's do this. Woo! Let's get this ammo. This ammo. This ammo. <laughs> okay, so those guys spit. Oh, man. Yeah. Whoa. Ow. Okay. Oh. My God. Don't be doing that to me. Ugh, ugh, so many. Yeesh. A lot of spiders. Big guy. Check out this rocket launcher. Ready? Woo! Dum -dum 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 -dum. Huh. Need to reload. Oh my god! This is my corner. Come on. Go, 
Go, go, go, go, go. That hurt. That was too far. Yeesh. Ow. Uh, okay. Come on, let's dance. Am I good? Where are you? Okay, I think that's it. Did I do good? I think he left. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. He does, he does not like us being here. We got something here. Damn it. What? Hold on. We may have a problem. I need to take a closer look. Cool. Did it! Very nice. So the scientists broke up. They found this place, and then the girl decided to go explore. So what happened to the rest of the station? All speed and trajectory evidence say it should be right here. So what happened to it? I got a theory. What if it just skimmed here, like a stone? That would put the final crash site another, well, maybe 15, 16 clicks away? Hmm. I'll crunch the numbers. Can you stretch your rations that far? Yeah, I'm good. I purged the hab, by the way. Pressure's holding. It's actually pretty comfortable in here. Okay. But we're not staying. Grant. Grant, I have a little emergency here. What is it? I think I may be going insane with boredom. You do know we're in the middle of the most fascinating scientific opportunity in human history. Yeah, I know. But I still wish they would put an FM station in these helmets. I need some drive time! <laughs> well, the only station you get out of here is... me. And my singing voice? Let's just say most people would choose boredom over torture. You know I have to make the sick now, right? I warn you, I only know the lyrics to Delamitri songs. Delamitri? Well, that shot's fired because I happen to love Delamitri. No, you don't. I do. No one loves Delamitri. I do. I do. And no one in the entire universe knows that except for you. I don't know. Seems like husband knowledge, right? Oof. Wrong move, guy. Are you there? Yeah, I'm here. Hey. Look up at the stars, will you? It's incredible. No one in human history has seen the universe from this position before. Isn't that crazy? Pretty crazy. You know, we could just bed in and set up an outpost here. How do the rations look? Actually, there seem to be a lot of rotten packs. And I mean a lot. 90% maybe. Was the Pilgrim do a resupply? I don't know. They're rotten? Yeah, but the honeys are all fine, so we should be fine. 
Okay. Now how about, um, you just quickly sing me all of Delamitri's greatest hits. <laughs> oh, you're it now, my friend. <gasps> Look around your world, pretty baby, is it ever... Oh my god. Well, that was interesting. So, all of their rations, or 90% of their rations are rotten, which is interesting because I'm pretty sure that, you know, space food doesn't usually go bad very easily. So that's something to take note of. Um, but yo, check this out. Isn't this cool? Ready? I don't want to live! <laughs> you can kill yourself. Isn't that awesome? I just thought that was cool. That's kind of dark, but you know what? I liked it. I think we're going to stop it there for that episode, so I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, be sure to look out for the next episode of this coming out pretty soon. I'm going to try and get this done while I have like this short breathing room. But until then, guys, I hope you guys have a great week, and I will talk to you in the next one. So until then, peace.